What's poppin', man? It's Woke New Whiskey. I'm just trying to survive. I'm just trying to have a good day, and it's a beautiful struggle. It ain't MK Ultra. It's psychology. Take the red pill and wake up. All right, so look, I got to get straight into it. I got to go to work. You know what I mean? Look, listen, listen, listen. They got all these YouTubers talking about manifestation, right? Manifestation. And I'm, I'm always thinking like, dang, why do they keep saying that? Why do they keep saying that? I got the receipts. You know what I'm saying? I got the receipts and I'm about to react to this YouTuber named The Spiritual Hooper. The Spiritual Hooper. <laughs> but look, before I play the video, listen, you got to watch out for the wolves in sheep clothing. Now watch how I do this. Watch this. First thing or one thing that you can expect when your manifestation is coming is you start to get a sense of fear, a sense of fear. You start to get very anxious and you take it as fear. You don't know why it seemed like something bad is about to happen. And it seemed like it just comes out of nowhere. See what I'm saying? And this is because see anxious fear and like excitement is a very, it's clo close in, in and, and it's a close emotion, see what I'm saying? And your spirit knows what's coming. See what I'm saying? Your spirit, your higher self can see what you can't see and it's physical. And your, your spirit is excited and it's, it's anxious and it's, it's, it's excited for, for what's, what's coming and what's about to happen in your life. But you, your ego, your body doesn't know what's coming and doesn't understand this. And it okay. takes this excitement and it turns it into fear just because the society we live in the world we live in programs any form of any anytime we feel uncomfortable for us to take that all right so y'all heard what he said right so then i was thinking hey maybe we got something going here you know what i'm saying maybe we got some going here because there have been situations but i don't know what he's talking about when he say fear but there has been situations when i was just shocked and i got you know, something I wanted, but that doesn't mean it's always from God. You got to get a close relationship to God. So when I be listening to these YouTubers, I'd be like, dang, so do you even have a close relationship with God? And then I seen another video that he made. Watch this. What's up, y'all? Today I'm going to talk about the power of imaginal acts and visualization and how it helped me manifest $60,000 in just two or a little over. Sixty thousand dollars in just two or a little over two weeks. Sixty thousand dollars in little over two weeks. I want to hear this. Let, let's hear this. If I'm not mistaken, and yeah, I'm just gonna share with y'all how I did it, my experience. Um, for the people that didn't watch my first video, I'm a professional basketball player yeah. overseas, and this, I had got heavy into the readings or the teachings of Neville Goddard for the people that don't Neville God that don't know Neville Goddard I highly highly recommend there we go he was just talking sounding all good on the other video now he's talking about some book he read to help him manifest sixty thousand dollars that ain't from God <laughs> didn't y'all see the receipts that's crazy research and read some of his books very powerful stuff so yeah, I was reading a lot of his books throughout the year and I was injured towards the end of the season. So I wasn't playing, I wasn't practicing. I had a lot of time on my hands and I was doing my financials and I saw that I had spent $24,700 over the 10 months that I was there. So every day I would go into a state akin to sleep or a deep meditation, you can call it. And I would say to myself over and over again, I would affirm to myself, I would say the affirmation, all the money that I spend comes back to me multiplied. All the money that I spend comes back to me multiplied. And I will also imagine somebody calling me, a team calling me, an agent calling me and what? telling me that they have $50,000 for a short amount of time. Cause some. Oh. I'm done with this dude. Is y'all listening? He just said he meditated, and in that meditation, 
he imagines an agent giving him $25,000 or something like that. Like, <laughs> these dudes is wolves, man. Y'all got to listen. It's crazy. If y'all like more videos, you know, you want more like this, let me know, man. It's Vocal Whiskey. I'm gone.